Hi guys, it's Game Walkthroughs 22 back with another World of Nintendo review, and today we're having a look at the newest wave of 2.5 inch figures. This is Series 2 1 or Wave 7. Um, so, before we have a look at the figures, let's have a quick look at their packaging. Um, the first thing I want to note is that for um, figures like Cat Mario, um, Fire Luigi, Goomba, and then also um, this one, th this one right here, um, Ice Mario, um, he's not actually part of Series 2-1, um, but he's um, part of the newest um, Walmart wave, and right now he is currently a Walmart exclusive. Um, <coughs> I'm sure he'll break exclusivity eventually because, I mean, he's not worth, like, staying an exclusive because he's just a repaint of the regular Mario. Um, but, um, yeah, the, uh, the Cat Mario, the Fire Luigi, the, the Goomba, and, um, Ice Mario I all got in the Walmart packaging. And then the, um, the, the Prawn Plant in the Red Tube, or the Red Pipe. Cat Toad, Black Yoshi, and Tingle. I all got that. I all I got all of them in the um in the, the uh the blister the blister card packaging. So um I'll just show you one of the uh one of the um the Walmart packages for the the newest wave because I mean I mean they're all the same. Um so, here's all the figures you can get in the newest Walmart wave. So, there's Ice Luigi, I mean, there's Fire Luigi, Cat Mario, Goomba, Boo, Ice Mario, 8-Bit Modern Mario, which I still really want, still been looking for, um, the regular 8-Bit Mario, and then 8-Bit 8 8-Bit Link. So... And of course, uh... The 8 bit Modern Mario is a Walmart exclusive. Um, and then um, here is here's the box for, for Cat Toad. And it says series 2 1. And then here's the back of the box. Shows all, all the figures that are available in this wave, including a reprint of Bullet Bill. And here is Piranha Plants packaging. They didn't even bother to change the color of um of the Piranha Plants pipe. They just kept it green. But whatever. It's not that big of a deal. And then here is here's Black Yoshi's box. And the interesting thing about Black Yoshi is that I mean you would think that since he's just um he's just a repaint of he's just a repaint of Yoshi, um, you'd think that he would have the same description as the uh, the green Yoshi and the blue Yoshi have, but surprisingly, he has a different description. I'm actually gonna read it to you guys. Um, so under, so it says, black Yoshis are the only Yoshis that enjoy all the fruit, even the red peppers, as well as other things that the rest can't, such as black Shy Guys. He has a special power he possesses that allows his eggs to explode in gigantic explosions, destroying more than one enemy at a time, whenever the smile meter is full. Additionally, whenever a black Yoshi is a super happy Yoshi, his mobility while using the flutter jump is increased drastically until the invincibility wears off. So, that's uh, pretty interesting that um, it seems like black Yoshis are different than other colored Yoshis, and I never knew about that. Um, and then finally, last but certainly not least, we have Tingle's box, which was the one that I was most excited uh, for. Um, 
for when this wave was announced. And here's the back. So now let's have a look at the figures. <coughs> um, so I mean, you know, with these being two and a half inch figures, they only have normally up to three points of articulation, normally head and arms. Um, so here is here's Ice Mario. Nothing special, just a repaint of of the regular Mario. Detail looks pretty good. Um, articulation, um, head, head moves, and then his uh, his arms move. So. And here we have Cat Mario, which Cat Mario looks pretty cool. Can't wait for the uh, the four inch Cat Mario, which will be coming out in Wave Seven. So he looks uh, pretty cool. Articulation is um, so that goes 360 degrees all the way around, and then you can move his uh, his arms. So you can have his paws up like, <clears throat> like, meow. So pretty cool. I really like Cat Mario. And then we have Fire Luigi, nothing special, just a repaint of the regular Luigi. Um, I still think he's pretty cool. Well, he's one of my favorites in this wave. Head goes 360 degrees all the way around. And you can move his arms and then the Goomba um, just same as the uh, the four inch Goomba except he's just um, <laughs> just smaller and he only has one point of articulation which is you can twist his head 360 degrees all the way around and um, he just looks pretty cool. He's you know, one of my favorites in this wave. And then the uh, the red pir the uh, piranha plant and the red pipe. Um, pretty much the same thing as the regular piranha plant. In fact, I'll bring in I'll bring in the uh, the piranha plant and the green pipe just to do a quick comparison. So as you can see. Uh, They are, they're the same thing. Now, I know it looks like the red, the prawn plant and the red pipe looks bigger than the prawn plant and the green pipe, but um, it's only because his, um, his, his head, wait, let me see something. Um, it's only because his, like, his head is, like, raised a little bit. But um, other than that, they are, I mean, they're, they're exactly the same size. Um, just that his head is like, his head is more up than the, uh, than the piranha plant in the green pipe. So. And then we have Cat Toad, which, again, I think he looks uh, pretty cool. Um, I don't know if his head goes just 360 degrees all the way around. I'm not going to try to force it somewhere it's going to break. I'm sure it does, but I'm don't, I don't want to. I don't want to try it. And then his uh, can move his his arms and yeah, his paws be up like. <clears throat> And then Black Yoshi, uh, he looks pretty cool, really like him. Um, head goes 360 degrees all the way around, and his, um, his arms go 360 degrees all the way around. And 
And I'll just bring in the green and blue Yoshis just for the hell of it. So here is the uh, the two and a half inch Yoshi family so far. We've got green, black, and blue. Pretty cool. I really hope they do that they make colors. They do colors of um, of all the different Yoshis. That'd be pretty cool. I'm sure they will, knowing knowing how much they love repaints. And then finally, last but certainly not least, is probably my favorite in this wave, Tingle. So uh, Tingle looks um, pretty cool. Not really much I can say about him. It's, it's also nice how they included a base for him to stand up because, I mean, as you can see, the way he's positioned, I don't think he'd be able to stand up on his own. His head goes 360 degrees all the way around. And also, you can uh, you can move his arms. So that's pretty cool. I really love Tingle. I think Tingle turned out pretty good. And with that said, that is the entire series two dash one or wave seven of the two and a half inch figures. I think they all look pretty awesome. Um. Unfortunately, um, half of this wave um, is pretty hard to find. That's mainly because um, of the um, the quantities for each for each figure um, in each case. Um, so there's normally a case of sixteen. Um, Tingle and Black Yoshi are the hardest to get because they're only one per case. Um, Cat Toad and Piranha Plant are only two per case, and I believe, um, and then I believe, um, Cat Mario, F uh, Fire Luigi, uh, and Goomba are three per case. I think, I'm not sure. Um, but Black Yoshi and Tingle are the biggest pain in the ass to find. Um, so just be aware of that. Um, and then, like I said, Ice Mario is not part of this wave. He's part of the the new Walmart wave, and right now he is a Walmart exclusive. But I'm sure he will break exclusivity eventually because, like I said, he's just a repaint of the regular Mario. So, um, but um, other than that, I highly recommend this wave. I mean, if you can um, find them, definitely pick them up. Um, they're all pretty pretty kick ass. Um, can't wait for the, uh, for the other, um, waves of the two and a half inch figures coming in the next, in the next, um, coming in the, uh, the coming months. Hopefully we won't have to wait too long for the next, the next, uh, two waves to, to be released. But, um, yeah, that's really all I have to say. Um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please be sure to like, comment, most importantly, subscribe. Uh, for more videos coming soon. And uh, yeah, we'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.